Hey, I made this video just fighting the remain a faithful servant to the Most High, the Highway, Jesus, Yahshua, Mashiach, through the Holy Spirit, needing things through His Holy Spirit, through His Rock I, I've been seeking the Most High diligently. I still have. I still been seeking Him. I still been digging as deep as possible. I want to say this to you. I do this video and I wanted to say to you, if you were willing, I'm moving, there's a family that is open, they're home to me. And I'm going to be taking a trip to them, you know, as I'm seeking the most high, doing his will, doing according to how he wants things done. And I'm faced with a choice that Jonah can testify to. Like the choice was like he went to one town, but the most house telling him to go somewhere else. But he went to this other, he was going in the direction of this other place instead. I'm not doing that. What I want to say to you is this. You know, say Jonah went the direction the most I told him to go. Would there have been a supernatural blessing? Would there have been a supernatural, something supernatural that happened on his behalf? That's what I've been pondering. Y'all don't know, but I've been seeking the Most High and digging as deep as possible. All I do is think about His will. All I've been doing is meditating on His His will day and night, morning, noon, and night, to be honest. And I'm going the direction He's asking me to go. I'm seeking Him for unique things. I'm seeking Him for that burning bush. And I'm going the direction He's asking me to go. You know, a friend, a friend of mine is, and his, you know, a friend of mine opened his, his home to me, knowing just everything I've been seeking him for, knowing anything, just knowing everything. And I'm, I need to get out to him, you know, and I'm going to, it's going to be, I'm going to be on this trip for, for a couple of days, almost a week. If y'all are willing, please help me, please donate to me um, so I can have money for hotels, money for gas. You know, I'm making this trip out there. And pray for me because I don't want to return to my Egypt. I don't want to return back to my hometown. I'm seeking the most high and I'm fighting to remain within his will. To keep righteousness alive. I, what I seek affects y'all. Y'all don't know. Like, I, like a lot of y'all that's just been with me, that's been testifying, been knowing everything that's been going on with me, you knowing what's been happening. I have been seeking the most high, like, seriously. I have truly, honestly, genuinely been seeking the most high, like, I need to. And the reason why I'm telling you that is because I want to do by you all. I'm seeking things from the most high, supernatural things to do by you all. Like, when I say I've been on the job, I've been on the job. When I say I've been seeking the most high, I have been seeking the most high. You know, I um what I talk to y'all about is all I think about. That's the only thing that's ever been on my mind, man. That's it. If y'all were willing, you know what I'm saying? If y'all are willing to help me, donate to me, that'll be great. I'm seeking the most out of the best that I can throughout this time. I will continue to. May the most I lead you, however. I don't tell y'all this to tell you this. That shows the most I live. A lot of y'all that have been with me, that's been backing me, praying for me, donating to me. I'm seeking the most high so I can do by y'all, man. With supernatural things. That's all I have. Like I that's all I think about morning, noon, and night. I'm just making this move off faith. Honoring voices heard. Honoring a will, honoring a will done. That's beyond my own.
if y'all were willing to, I'm making this move off of it. The only thing I say to you is I just keep virtue and righteousness alive throughout all my days, throughout this move. This is all I have. You know, I the reason why I brought up Jonah is because I had dreams about things in my hometown, things about the state I'm in, dreams, visions. I, I, I don't even, I can't even keep tabs on how many. But I'll share it with you this. I laid down and it was like a couple weeks ago, I saw, I saw this home I used to live. And I saw a hurricane, strong winds. It was like a hurricane going through it. And it was powerful. And and this wind was just strong. This 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 rain was just hard. And when I looked at it, when I looked at how hard it was coming down, I looked at and I knew I was looking at. I was looking at a, a consequence from a poor choice made. And I knew it. And it's like, and I'm like, why am I having this? This part, you know what I'm saying? Let's just move forward. Like, why am I having this? And I just treated it like that. Like, why am I having this? And just like that. And as time went on, I started to understand this is why I'm having it. As I was going through the hardship I've been going through lately, this is why I'm having it. Because a choice would bring me to this place. A choice and a doubt would bring me to this place where I would go over here. And hardship would put me to that. And I was like, okay. Okay. And it made me say, it made me seek the most high. Like, God, I, I want to help you. I want to be here for you, man. I want to really help you, man. And the reason why I'm telling you all that is because that's all I'm thinking about. It's going in the direction he's asking me to go. going in a direction he's asking me to go. And I'm trying not to go in this direction where I saw the rain, the torrents, this, because it's almost like I was making the same choice Jonah made. You know, the thing I say to y'all is this, and the thing I've been bringing to the most high, and I know I have. What if Jonah went the opposite way? Should it have just been, should he not have got something supernatural for it? Okay, say say I do, say as a person I done wrong, right? I done wrong and this is the consequence. I see the consequence, yes, this is the consequence because of what I've done. But is it too much to ask? And is it too much? To not cease to something supernatural in that same way. Is it too much to not see something supernatural in that same way? And it's not a, it's not a, a, a punishment, but it's a blessing? Is it too much to, on this plane, on this side of glory, to aid the faithfulness, have our faith rewarded? That's what I've been seeking the most high for. It's things so we're able to have our faith rewarded. You know, when I would say to y'all stuff like, yo, I'd be frustrated with the most, I really genuinely would. Because it's almost like, okay, say I carried off in a way to anger them. I did something to anger them. I did something to disappoint them. Well, I did something to anger him, and his anger is against me. And he makes known supernaturally, my anger is against you. 
the frustrating place it would put me at is, okay, you wanted a friendship with me? All right, I'm going to meet you on that foundation. How come as I was, as a friend, as a friend, I would do by you and I do by you and I do by you the best that I could. And when I would do right, it's like I wouldn't get nothing or I wouldn't see nothing for my labors. But now that I've done something to anger you, how come you don't give me something there? You can give me something when you're angry at me, but how come I can't see the reward for what I went through? Or, or how come I can't just, but I can see you being angry at me? How is it different from rules without relationship? A lot of people discipline their children rules without relationship. So they'll discipline them for breaking the rule, but it won't be a relationship. That's something I could testify to because that's something I've been through. The point that I'm making to y'all all is this. Rules without relationship, that's the rationale that will start to bear fruit. The reason why I'm talking to y'all like this is because I'm asking y'all to help me out on faith. I'm asking you to. I'm begging you to. Because it's like, as sure as the most I live, I want to help y'all. And I see ways to help y'all. But the only thing I've been doing is waiting on the most I live. The most I is sending me to this location. And y'all, all faith has been helping me. I'm asking you for y'all to do it again. Because as sure as the most I live, I will help you. Just pray on it. If you want to help me, help me. If you want to donate to me, donate to me. If you're not able to get in contact with me for a week or so, it's because I'm in the process of, I'm, I'm on my journey. That's all. I just want to make this known to y'all. All right.